chunks of mine ore up to three feet in diameter go through the first stage of primary crushing. Two further stages reduce the ore to less than one half inch fragments. This is conveyed to the fine ore bin. The next move is to the grinding mill. The finely crushed ore now goes through grinding processes, starting with a passage through two rod mills, big drums containing heavy steel rods which tumble and grind the crushed ore. The ore, mixed or slurried with water, continues into two ball mills, where steel balls reduce it to particles small enough to release the copper. Quality control is rigidly observed at all stages of the milling operation. Here, a sample of grinding mill slurry is tested for density. It's a far cry from the day when Hustis and Reynolds pushed ore from the first digging. The finely divided ore is now ready for flotation, the process which separates copper particles from the mineral waste. An organic chemical added to the pulped ore coats the copper specks, causing them to adhere to chemically frothed air bubbles. The operator controls the process as the copper-loaded froth is skimmed off, carried to other flotation stages, and finally to the concentrate filters. The vacuum removes residual water, and the clinging concentrate is scraped from the filter discs.